Good morning, good morning, or may, yeah, still morning. Good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are in this whole wide world. Praise God, praise God. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. And um, I actually had got on here. I had some news yesterday that someone sent me. And so I just want to tell you what's going on to be prayerful. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. You got to stay prayed up in this day. Oh, y'all don't hear me. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. I'm telling you, this is a season. Please pay t- close attention to what I'm saying. This is a season where the enemy is after you to steal, kill, and destroy. And by any means necessary, it does not matter who you are and whose you are. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. He has an assignment against the people of God. And either you're being used against the people or you, uh, the people of God, or you're praying for the people of God. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. And the reason why I'm saying this, I want to... So this happened a couple of days ago, you know, like... Um, the, the pastor that got killed in a car wreck, Virginia mega church mourns loss of lead pastor killed in car crash. Y'all remember that? Pray people pray those that have a prayer life. Okay. So then I want to go to what happened on yesterday. Um, well, basically I think over the weekend, last weekend, um, so newlywed pastor, they were found shot to death in their bed. So and there was a handgun found. Now, I'm not sure. So this is LaRonda Jones and her husband, Eric, an elder. And this is out of um, RIM City Church in Connecticut. So that's two in less than a week's time. So that lets me know that there's an assignment. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Let me tell y'all something. The enemy is out to steal, kill, and destroy all of us. He's not playing with us. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. I've just... If you've been following me, you know for a fact that I've been given prophecies and it's, it hasn't even, the next year hasn't even started yet. And I see these things coming to pass. This is not the time to be laxy daisy. And I, I'm not trying to ruin your Thanksgiving, those that celebrate it. You know, we'll be supposed to be thankful every day. But I'm just here to tell you that this is a season where we have to stay prayed up and stay on alert. They are allowing all kind of things to happen. Sex trafficking, human trafficking, organ trafficking. You, you, you guys don't see what's going on? Come on, somebody, hallelujah. And so it's like this. You have to stay prayed up. Now, you're going to have some good days. You're going to have some bad days, but you have to be consistent. What I'm finding out is that people really love God. Y'all love God. Most of you love God. Yes, you do. But you're just not consistent, meaning that you move off of your emotions, meaning that how you feel, how you roll. True children of God, we don't get to do that. We can have a bad day. God said, um, you got business to take care of. You don't, you got to pray. You got, <laughs> y'all don't hear me. This is real. This is real. I'm not saying that it's, it's not okay. You can have your, your feelings validated. But what I am saying is that the enemy, he is always working 365 days a year. You guys, we have to learn how to be consistent, learn how to pray, learn how to fast, even when it hurts. And yes, it could be hurtful. Everybody goes through it. There is nobody without a problem, but it is how you go through it. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. As a matter of fact, truth be told, you know, when people find out what you're really made of, when that enemy comes at you, oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Because two things going to happen. Either you're going to buckle and run. Are you going to stand and pray? Oh, come on, somebody. I'm just telling like a T.I. is. It's the truth. Either you're going to say, you know what, devil, if it's on, it's on. Because this stuff is not funny. You know, um, so they found a handgun. So, you know, I already know what they're saying. One of them killed the another. So that's why I did not just do a video on marriage. So allegedly, we don't know for sure, right? But we're going to find out soon. Y'all know they're going to tell it. I'm just saying, stay prayed up. It's not about getting in fear. Just stay prayed up, you know, and pray for both, all three of these people. You know, the pastor that got killed in the car wreck. Just pray. Just keep praying for people. Now, he was out of, I think, Virginia. Yeah, um, Dr. Dimitri Bradley. So, just pray. But this happened in less than a week. Three um, church leaders. So, something's going on. There is definitely an assignment against the church. We already know that. But stay prayed up. Stay alert. You got to pray, people. Please be diligent in praying. That's one of the things God told me to tell you on here. You have to be diligent in praying. Now, we all going to go. Don't get it twisted. So, I'm not saying be afraid of death because, trust me, we all have a day. Hallelujah. But stay prayed up. That's all I'm saying. So, therefore, because at the end, I know people, we just all living, right? Everybody living. But you need to really be thinking about what if a God allowed something to happen to me? Where, where would you really go? 
And this is real talk. Where would you really go? Where's your destiny? Where's your destination, may I say? So stay prayed up. And women, please, please, please watch because they trying to snatch people around here. You guys, you, I've been telling y'all, I've been telling y'all, you got to, don't let nobody just take you. No, 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 no. The devil is a lie. Stay on alert. Watch your children. Pray over your children. Pray over your grandchildren. Pray over your family. This is praying season like never before. Please don't get laxadaisy. Please. Hallelujah. Well, that's all I want to get up on here and tell you. So God bless you. Hallelujah. Take care. Be safe these holidays. Spend time with your family. Love on your family. Try not to get too drunk. Oh, come on. Y'all know y'all Christians. Some of y'all going to be tipsy like a uh, a boat. Go ahead, Shaq. Go ahead. Stop that. But I love you anyway. Just be safe. Be loving with each other. And be careful out there, please. It's sad. It's sad because we're living in a world where people don't want to go out at night. That Man, I, I never thought I'd live to see it. But here I am. I'm watching it. All right. God bless you, Roll Out Soldiers, for that is who we are. God bless.